Okay, this is game changing. You've probably heard it all about it in, in the news. OpenAI, the new software that Elon Musk has released into the public. And it's absolutely game changing. I tried it out for the last few days in order to write professional YouTube scripts. I do have to say it's not perfect yet, but it's slowly becoming literally perfect. And I wanted to dive into my screen right away to show you how this actually works. Right now you can see we're on the website called chat.open.ai.com slash chat. And what we can do is we can type in the top 10 best paid uh, soccer players. So now it will say it's hard to rank them, but it will give us numbers as exactly how this is going. So here it's Lily already is writing a story. That's insane. Uh, and then it's Lionel Messi, but I'm talking about the salary. I want to know the salary of every single one of these players. Um, but right now we're already getting a story for the top 10 best paid soccer players. What is absolutely insane. Seems to be very accurate, uh, having a lot of knowledge about soccer. Uh, I don't think there's a single mistake in here. I think this is the exact rankings as well. So it's already writing a decent story. However, for an eight minute long video, we need to have a minimum of 1200 words. And this will probably not be 1200 words. It will probably get a little bit close to it, but it's not yet long enough. Um, so what we could do is say include salaries and we'll probably scrape public data, include the salaries of, of the best paid soccer players, players. So you can play around with this and really get a number of here of estimates. So here's a 60 million and then it's 80 million and uh, Neymar is 75 million. So now it goes all over the place. So it's 60 towards 80 towards 75. So it's not in one order, uh, but it gives a lot of information here uh, right away. And this is really easy to research with. So you could either combine a little bit of text but the goal is to make sure it writes a perfect YouTube script. So what we can do now is create a story around these soccer players and mention their salary. Create a story around the soccer players and mention their salary going from low to high. I'm curious if this is happening correctly. Uh, we're all vying, so this is a mistake. It says vying instead of dying. Uh, so this is one mistake that the AI is making right now. So here it goes, Lily from low to high. 10 million, 22 million. Here it says 13 million. However, this is of course something that we can change manually. Um, so now it goes to 13 to 20 to 25. Uh, but we can literally switch this around in order to make sure everything is uh, being read uh, correctly. And yeah, here we could also mention something about the world finals. So you can see this is not yet perfect, but it's coming darn close in order to completely change the script writing game forever. And I'm absolutely mind blowing. Like I'm not doing anything. I'm holding my hands up and it's writing a complete story. Uh, finally, there's Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi, two of the greatest soccer players. Um, and so right now we got almost a full on script and now we can say, uh, make it 1200 words and again it makes the mistakes of vying instead of dying um, but now it's going to make the story a little bit bigger and with 1200 words we have enough for an eight minute video and after this we will go to the Google documents and change a few things in order to really be professional the reason why I'm not including any voice acting or editing AI is because I don't think it's either good enough. And the second thing is, is that by using a lot of these AI softwares, you actually don't get allowed into the YouTube partner program. So for that reason, we're not using those yet. But this will change the game in this field and it will also probably lower the cost slowly over the next few months as this software of course gets a lot better. Meaning that right now you could spend uh, $15 for a script but that could easily go down back to $5 meaning that if you do this there's barely any script or research to be written. You just have to know a little bit about the field, read over the script and you're done. 
So yesterday I made a script about actors for the program and it was literally perfect after a few tweaks here and there. And of course you need to be engaging. And now we could say, and this is the big part, so let's dive back into my screen, is we could say write a story, uh, write this story, but then for a YouTube audience. I wonder if this will do it. It's your favorite soccer fanatic here. And we're going to talk about the top 10 best paid soccer players. It's literally including you guys. Hey YouTube, it's your favorite soccer fanatic here. It's the AI, it's open AI, welcome. Um, so here you can see it's already saying 10 million, 22 million. I wonder if it does correctly now, it goes back up to 25 million. Um, but you can see in my screen, I'm not changing anything. No, so still making this mistake where it says 13 million after the 22. Um, so that's literally the only mistake it's making here in the salaries. Actually two, the 20 million should be above there as well. So there's a few mistakes here and there that could be improved upon. But this is coming darn close to be able to talk to a real audience, like the way that I'm talking towards you guys. It's absolutely nuts. So my recommendation is, and I will leave a link down below for this website for you to use it, is that it's the biggest game-changing uh, thing that we have ever seen in the last months and years. We will go from like a 1.0 civilization towards a 2.0 because this will like make everything a hundred times faster. Here it says number one is uh, Neymar, uh, but still lower than, and then continue. You can see that it hasn't written the story compact. Uh, finally, uh, lower than Salah's salary. That's weird because Salah have, didn't have the, uh, that salary. So it's making a few mistakes. But if we copy all of this text, and we will do that in a second, and bring it over to a Word document, and change a few things in order to be engaging towards the audience. Um, who do you think who deserves the top on the spot list? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and don't, subscri don't forget to subscribe for more soccer content. That's amazing. So right now we will copy this entire text. And funny that it says the vying instead of dying, lower than. And then we will go towards the documents, open a new one and then we will see the following thing. Okay, so right now I will open up the document and you can see that I'm copy pasting the text in here. So we got one and then we got two over here. So once we scroll down, you can literally see me copying everything. And now we got everything copied. What is absolutely insane. So this is the entire text. Hey YouTube, it's your favorite soccer fanatic here. And then over here we could do channel name. And today we're going to talk, going to be talking about the top 10 best soccer players in the entire world. Sounds a little bit bigger. In the entire world. These guys are some of the best players in the sport. Uh, so these are some of the best players in the sport of soccer. We're talking about soccer dedicated here. In the sport of soccer. And the salaries reflected. First off is Paulo Dilba, Dilbala, a talented Argentina player who plays for Juventus in the Italy Series A. I don't know what this is. In the Series A League, oh, that's the name. Daibala, if I pronounce his name correctly, is known for his dribbling ability, creativity, and goal scoring skills. And he's quickly becoming one of the most promising young talents in the sport. Despite his impressive talent, his salary, his salary is only around $10 million a year. Well, that's not bad. That's not what I'm earning. I can tell you, yeah, I might be good in my field, but I'm not earning $10 million a year. I wish. So here we have the 22 million. But here we have the 13 million. So what we can do is select this text, then make sure that we cut it in this case, and then use backspace, make sure everything is aligned. And then here we can say, after Salah, there's no Salah here, after, and then we have to change the name to Daibala, Daibala is Edison Cavana, a Uruguayan player who plays for Manchester United in the English Premier League. Cavani is known for his goal scoring ability and his physical style of play. And he is a long and successful career playing for clubs in Europe and South America. His experience and skills on the pitch has earned him a salary of around $13 million per year, which is a significant increase from Daibala's. Oh no, oh here it says Daibala's. It said correctly here, but it didn't say correctly here. So this is what you have to do in order to optimize the script for the best results possible. Here again, it says next is Kevin De Bruyne what is still possible but this is 20 million a year so we want to cut this and make sure that that's after 13 million 
and then we put it here. Next is Kevin De Bruyne, a Belgian player who plays for Manchester City in the English Premier League. De Bruyne is known for his passing ability in the creative midfield and he's widely regarded as one of the best playmakers in the world. His skills on the pitch have earned him a salary of around 20 million a year, which is a significant increase from Di um, Dybala. Basildo Donsola. Yeah, and on here we can say Dybala. Dybala earnings, but still lower than Salah's salary. Next, uh, and then here we can make like a joke, so we could uh, do like, next is Mohamed Sidney, a Egyptian player who plays for Liverpool in the English Premier League. Salah is known for his speed, dribbling ability, and clinical finishing, and he's quickly become one of the most exciting players to watch in the league. His skills on the pitch have earned him a salary of $22 million a year, uh, per year, which is a significant increase from Dabalas. Um, there is a significant increase from Dabala, and Dabala was here, and then it's correctly a significant increase from. And then here we have to put down Kevin de Bruyne. Kevin de Bruyne. Uh, if you wish to become the best soccer player, soccer player in in the world, you have to make sure, have to make sure to subscribe to Wonder to get better at YouTube automation. But if you wish to become the best soccer player in the world, you have to make sure to subscribe to, and then not our channel, but your our channel is X channel, to, and this is your channel. And then if you wish to become the best soccer player in the world, make sure you subscribe to Soccer Fanatic, what it says in the beginning, Soccer Fanatic. Um, and then you could say, let's continue. After the Brun is Anthony Griezmann, a French player who plays for Barcelona in the Spain's La Liga. So this is really good. Next is Eden Hart, and then after that, it earned him salary of around twenty million dollar. That's probably incorrect. Should be above here. I don't want to make the video too long, but you see these small changes that I'm making towards the script in order to literally make it a perfect video. Next is Neymar, and then finally on top there's Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi. This is the only bit of text that would be labeled like orange that would be completely incorrect. So this is because here it's talking about seventy-five million a year. Then it goes back down to 60 million a year. Then it goes back up to 80 million a year. So this should all be switched around in order to literally make it perfect. So if you read this carefully, next is Neymar Jr., a Brazilian player who plays for Paris Saint-Germain. In France League 1, Neymar is known for his speed, skill and creativity on the pitch. And he is one of the highest paid soccer players in the world. His skills on the pitch have earned him a salary of around $75 million a year which is a significant increase from Mbappe, who actually recently just got uh, announced that his new salary is literally like 200 million, what is the highest paid soccer player almost ever uh, during the peak. Um, so that's interesting, but that's new data. It's catching data from 2020 and before, it's not 2022 yet, so it doesn't know that yet. So this is where the AI sometimes can make a little bit of mistakes. Then I wanted to do the ending with you in order to really let you know of how it works. So there you have it, the top 10 best played, uh, paid soccer players in the world. Who do you think deserves a top spot on the list? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more soccer content. Don't forget to subscribe to Soccer Fanatic, the channel name Soccer Fanatic for more soccer content for daily soccer content. Daily soccer content. And the next thing you could do is you could make a divide. So you could either say, make sure you subscribe and you end off the video. Or what you could do is you could say, if you want to see the best goals ever of the top players, make sure to check out this video on the left. I have no idea how it works. That could either be this side or I could do this side. And then here I could show a video that you could watch next as an example. The only thing what I'm saying here is watch the best goals ever. Compilation videos, of course, are not monetized. But if you add a lot of audio on it and you're a really good commentator, you could make something like that work. Um, but just saying that as a disclosure here before anyone starts making soccer compilation videos and not being monetized. That being said, this is how YouTube automation works with an AI as a script writer. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you saw the little tweaks that I made here and there uh, in order for you to be able to make your own scripts and save some money. If you enjoyed these videos and you want to learn more, make sure you send me a message on at one or cash cow saying blueprint. And if you do so, you will receive a completely free blueprint by me personally. That being said, thank you so much for watching and I wish you a very beautiful day.